hello guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back to this channel <laughs> and if you're a new subscriber thank you so much for clicking on this video make sure that you subscribe if you haven't like the videos uh, share and yeah so in today's video i'm going to be doing a get ready with me kind of video um, and it's going to entail makeup because i don't know how to do my makeup like perfectly but yeah i'm just going to have fun with it not um, a makeup guru at all at all yeah so i'm just having fun with it i'm just winging it and we'll see how the outcome looks like so yeah so let's go and do our makeup so i think in this video i'm going to be doing a voiceover because the kids outside are so noisy and yeah so i think i'm going to be doing a voice over yeah so subscribe if you haven't like share i know i've already said that but i'm going to repeat it again because i want you to yeah to hear me to hear me <laughs> so yeah let's get into the video So to begin the whole makeup process, my face is already moisturized and this is my tiny makeup bag. It contains all the makeup that I own, like literally no cup. So yeah, let's begin the makeup process and we are going to begin with the primer. I use the LA Girl Primer. Yeah, I use the LA Girl pro prep primer that is what it's called <laughs> yeah so we are going to apply that on the face and then continue with the process tell my baby i ain't nothing like the last one so she hold it down to the back home break the bread down to the last after the primer, the next uh, step I do is the eyebrows. I use the Davis pencil number three, the brown eye pencil. And yeah, so let's do our eyebrows. So for the eyebrows, I will just basically make sure that my eyebrows are cleaned out. Like they are shaved and shaped. <laughs> yeah, then just draw the, the, lower, the lower line of the eyebrow. And then draw the upper line of the eyebrow, fill that in, and then go on with the concealer. After filling in the brows, I use a spoolie to make sure that I blend everything in and the eye pencil doesn't have harsh lines and uh, yeah so you just blend that right in there and make sure that it is it is evenly distributed then go on with the concealer so for the concealer i use the la girl pro conceal concealer i use two shades one is the lighter one is toffee and the darker one is espresso and uh, yeah so one is too light for me one is too dark for me so i mix them up and get the perfect shade now i know i'm supposed to use the lighter one for the underbrows and etc etc but again i'm not a guru so i just do what i'm comfortable with <laughs> basically I'm 
feel I'm with you To give it all I can Even though I think I lost my patience And I ain't trying myself so open Not today And I won't leave them too intoxicated So for the foundation, I use the Simply Edgeless 3-in-1 Liquid Foundation by Kiss Beauty. And I use the shade number 3. And I use a brush to blend that in. So after the foundation, I go back to the eyes with my eyeshadow palette. I don't really apply eyeshadow every day. I actually don't do makeup every day. I just do my brows. This happens in rare occasions. So anyway, I start with the shade Zulu. It's a very dark brown color. You can't even notice it. And yeah, I just apply it as the base of the eyeshadow and blend that in. Then uh, for the outer lid of my eye, if that makes sense, I go in with the black color. It is called Fulani and blend that in. Make sure that it looks, you know, decent. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. 
then for the inner corner stroke lid of my eye i use the shade cairo it is a gold glitterish shade which blends in very well with the black color in my opinion so i go ahead and use the mixed concealer that i mixed earlier to conceal my under eyes to conceal my forehead and any other part on the face that needs some type of brightness and i use a beauty blender to blend that in I'm with the pack, better sit and relax. Gotta keep me a second, your girl wanna date me. Whoa, I got a trip full of flows. Not even half of it shown. Spies on the low, spitting for sure. Don't need to tell me, I already know. Flying past the clouds, where there's no sound. Ain't coming back down. I stand for now. Fine, cooking inside of my room, ain't nobody gon' know. so after i'm done blending out the concealer and everything is on the face i go in with my setting powder in the shade buttercup i bake or put some <laughs> in the places where i've concealed then set the rest of my face and then come back and blend in the parts where i have baked so after my setting powder i go in with my la girl pro setting spray which basically helps set makeup for long lasting wear now going in with my mascara uh, to brush those lashes and making sure that they are in place and looking neat i've never like bothered myself to buy eyeliner because uh -uh, mm -mm, i almost went blind trying to learn how to apply eyeliner so as per now i just do mascara now for the last part which is my lips i went in with a brown lip liner and then i go in with a lip gloss or lipstick and for this particular day i decided to go in with lipstick so i use a basic maroon lipstick for my outer 
lining of the lips then for the middle part i go in with a pink lipstick and it creates a very good combo snakes in the grass trying to bite me next year no telling what it might be spying in the crib keeping to myself I have a tendency to give what i need some help I really need to hear my brother tell him how it felt cause anything about a chance to you let yourself so what i'm asking is you hold me down i don't want no trouble when you come around cause i'll be on fire and not sound ain't nobody got time for the ride around